Always tracking, always alerting. Here's your Storm Track 15 weather. Welcome back 518. Acadiana has been stuck in this weird rainy weather pattern for the rainy weather pattern. Yeah, well, Rain, whatever uh, it is, it's, it's we get the gist. Yeah, it's been raining a lot lately. It's very wet. Looks to probably be sticking around. Adam, what can you tell us? I know yesterday here in Lafayette, it rained. I think like a little bit. I can't I tell. I don't think it, it rained at my house, but there were a little few light rain showers yesterday. But because of some storms off to our west, we dodged a lot of the rain. Well, that's good because it's still so wet. Well, we out can't there. say the same for all of Acadia. Mm -mm. And you know, here's the thing: we can't say the same for today because it does look like we are going to be dealing with some more showers and thunderstorms in your forecast. So we start this off. Maybe you're headed offshore. Maybe you're just going fishing in a little lake or bayou there. We are looking at some more wet conditions possibly later on. Now again, it's very possible you don't see anything at all, but more than likely you're going to run into some showers and thunderstorms. Nine o'clock, we're looking at some showers out there. 81 degrees by midday in the mid 80s with some thunderstorms firing up and by three o'clock, 86 degrees. Now the reason that today I think we're going to see a little bit better rain chance out there than what we did yesterday. Look at this massive rain that's down around the Texas coast, bringing lots of flooding over towards Corpus Christi. Well, this eastern edge of it is slowly creeping towards the Louisiana coastline. Now, right now, there's not much going on currently on radar, but we are going to be watching for more of those showers to start developing as we head into the morning time and our future cast shows this pretty well by nine o'clock still not tracking a whole lot, but one or two showers may form up. Now you're going to have clouds out there. It's not going to be a beautiful sunshiny day, but we are looking at that edge of the rain starting to creep on shore here by midday. Again, some of us may miss out on the rain, but here's what happens by three o'clock. According to the future cast, all that rain that's offshore finally begins to make its way onshore as we head into the afternoon and evening hours, leading to kind of a rainy time there between 3 and 7 p.m. at least, but the rain chances may actually linger through the overnight. Now our temperatures will be in the 80s this afternoon. Farther north where the rain takes a little bit longer, you will be bumping up to near 90 degrees. Overnight, we'll be looking for those mid 70s in the forecast. Very typical of what we've been having with a few showers lingering. And then as you would expect tomorrow, we're doing it all over again. Mid to upper 80s, pop up showers and storms. Some of those could be heavy. And as we go forward in time, it does look like we start to lose some of the rain chances. But a big change today from yesterday. Looks like another one of these stalled fronts is going to be sticking around next week. So we could do this all over again. I don't know if I'm ready for that yet. <laughs> uh, well, we are certainly not. I'll just go ahead and answer for you there, Carter. Yeah. But you know what? What can you do? The totally understandable. The cycle continues. Mm -hmm. All right. Thanks very much, Adam. We'll be checking back soon.